Every time a cowboy gets on a bull or a horse, they know there is a big danger. It's just part of the sport. Utah County native Jesse Davis was one right away from ending his career without a major injury when everything changed. He wanted to do it every single day. For years, this has been the office of Jesse Davis. He's done it his whole life. It's his regular routine, you know, eight seconds at a time. Last Saturday, his wife Cassidy and their twin daughters were sitting front row at the Maverick Center watching Jesse's rodeo career right off into the sunset. It's in his blood. He that's why he was having a, such a hard time wanting to retire. Cassidy hoped to capture the moment with this video. <laughs> this was Jesse's final ride before retirement. I just kept thinking there's no way Jeff he'll get up. He'll walk out of it. But this time Jesse didn't get up. We just said our prayers. Casey Field, a longtime friend, was one of the first people to run to Jesse's side. The video does not do that justice at all. The horse crushed Jesse's liver. 1300 pound horse, however big he was coming down on you when you're kind of cockeyed like that. You know, it was kind of bad. Jesse was rushed to IMC in Murray. He lost a large amount of blood, but doctors there were able to save his life. Jess is tough. He doesn't complain much. He never has. And the doctors actually said that they're extremely amazed with what he has done. This is the cruelest way to end a successful career. He made it seven seconds into his ride. In a sport judged by what you do in eight seconds, all it took was the very last second to change Jesse's life. Jess is pretty tough, and he always comes back uh, tougher than he was before. The World Champions Rodeo Association has set up a fundraiser to help Jesse and his family. You can find that link on our website. The family also wants to remind everybody to donate blood. In this case, that really saved Jesse's life. In the studio, John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah.